，早上好，欢迎大家来到这期绿洲看房。今天我们来帮我们 Eric 大哥和嫂子来看一下他们过户的房子。Hey Carl, Yo. Oh my God, you showing up? How you doing, buddy? Good, how are you? I'm fine. Right. Okay. We're gonna start right out with here. Okay. And then we're gonna do some stuff, and then from there we're gonna go up to the master and work our way down. All right. You guys finished the outside already? Yeah. House huh? needs a lot of work. Okay, so they got they got a lot of stuff to do, but they're working on it. Okay. Okay. I've already got eight items. Okay. Oh. I need texture. This is the main electrical panel. Okay. It is not complete because of all the other breakers we have not put in yet. They steal them, so we wait till the day you close, then we put them in. Okay. You go home, so add a key to the key. Add a key to the key. Main shut off. Right here. Okay. 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 And you're calling the gas company and me, okay? Now I want to warn you about those loops. If you forget to pay your bill, the gas company comes out and rotates it around, puts the lock through it. Uh, don't let that happen. One person did. Somebody over on the other, over there. Garden side. No, here. Oh, here. They did their walk through, and then went to China for a month and a half. Oh. And when he came back, he called me up and says, Carl, I got no power, no nothing. For I sure, said, yeah, of course, yeah. Bill, the queen <laughs> life, and then, oh, give him a call. <laughs> So. Yeah, they respond pretty quick. Last time uh, I had a home. They uh, respond real quick. Yeah, at home they have they have small leak here. It's a brand new home. They just, it's a potty home over there. Okay. So um, the gas company like within one hour the guy came fixed. Gas gas company responds probably the fastest because of the danger. Right. That's why they're so fast. Yeah, they're so fast. They uh they put a new gas a gasket. Oh, yeah, to fix these. Okay. I just marked that because it's dirty. No, the lights. No. Oh, the light. oh, no, no lights. No lights. No lights. Yeah, if they, Johnny put them in. Somebody stole them over there. Mm -hmm. Oh. Okay. So when you get moved in, you're gonna need to call them back and say, "I'm here now. Can we please get this thing activated?" It can take up to three, four weeks. Because they make you an account and all kinds of stuff. Okay. Okay. Yeah. So, gas stuff out in the garage. This is sort of strange, and it's new, but we're putting them in now. That is a created gas stub out for when gas-powered vehicles come into play. They don't even make it. I don't think only gas-powered vehicles that are out there are owned by the gas company and the trash company, but not for home. But we put it in anyways. Okay. Uh, what's the blue? Blue? Yeah. Pink. Pink. Oh, okay. I want that patch now. Okay. This cat right there. That is your pre-wire for 240 for electrical vehicle. Mm -hmm. Okay. So if you ever get one or if you have one, that's these, right? This cat right here. You can have that installed. And Charge your car. This so is 100 times to 240. Right? 240. Only 240? Yeah. Two, 240. 240. You put it in more, you blow the car out. Okay. Okay. Power and hold for strength or timer. If you recommend, if you have one put in, have your gardeners put it right there. And that is for if you do some kind of sprinkling system in the backyard. If you don't, then don't worry about it. Yeah, there's no sprinkle system. What's that? There's no uh, sprinkle system. Not in the back. Backyard is unfinished. Oh, okay. Okay. And again, too, that's only if you want. Now, you have a big backyard, so you might want to put one in. Some of the houses we had over there, garden side, little teeny yard, that would be bothered. Okay. This thing. 
called a world time clock. It controls the lights on the exterior of the house. These ones on the garage, the one on the back porch here, your front porch, everywhere there's a light outside that controls it. Now you will need to learn to program that thing, and I'm going to give you a piece of paper on it. Um, so you can have to come on at six, go off at four, whatever you want to do. But until you learn to do that, you can put it into a manual mode just by hitting it one time. Okay? They will come on, they will stay on for 24 hours, then turn off. Okay? It's another way of conserving energy. Uh, keeping, keeping people from leaving their lights on all night long when they don't need to. Someone tell me one hour. What's that? Someone tell me it lasts one hour. If you get it, the, the manual, yeah, one hour is correct. Not 24, what do you mean 24 hours? Well, no, I was told 24. You were told 24, okay. Yeah. yeah, somebody tell me one. Okay. Whatever. Those two panels there are city inspectors. Tankless water meter. Set to 120. Yeah. See the control panel here? That's the maximum. You can't go above that. You can go below it. But 120 seems to be the temperature that works for everybody. Uh, they preset this, the plumber. And the reason why they don't want you going over that is little children getting burnt. 120 is sensitive, right? Yes, Fahrenheit. Mm -hmm. yeah. That's probably what, 65, 66 centigrade? I don't know. No, 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 not, not that high. Like, uh, like, okay, no, no, like 45 something, yeah. Right. yeah. Okay, this device here, and not everybody gets one of these, but you do, because this tells me that you have a big tub upstairs, right? Okay. Yes. This is an anti scalding device, again, too, for little kids. If an unattended child got into the master bath and turned the pot on full blast and jumped in, he could burn himself. This device will detect that and start having cold water. So it's something you never touch. But that tells me when I see that you've got a big Roman tub up there. Drain on Okay, every year you're going to need, to need to have this serviced, and that's what that's for. We'll put them on it right now. I'll tell you about that down the road. Okay. okay. Your garage door motor, okay? It's already programmed, so when you need the keys, when you need the remote screw, these are also Wi Fi friendly, okay? You can download the app, put it in your phone. Okay, I'm going to give the information for that, for I'm not the control right there. Okay, also too, the new ones, these now have a battery back with it. So if the house was to lose power, it still works. It's slower, but it will be close to the garage. You don't have to pull cord manually lift it. Okay, what can you do Your fire scraper system. Okay. Nothing you do here, this is self-contained. I just open it up and show you again. You have about 100 pounds of water pressure. You're good to go. That's what we need to do. In 22 years of doing this, I've only ever had one of those fail. So they're pretty self-contained. This company even leaves extra parts if they need to come out and change out, change the head. Main water disconnect for your house. Okay? Now, if you ever have a leak going inside and you can't stop it by other ways of which I'm going to show you, worst case scenario, come out here, you lift that, the whole house is off. Okay? So, go away on a vacation for maybe two weeks, turn the water off to the house. You don't need it, you don't need it on. Okay? And this one won't control the sparking system. Oh, it will control everything. Not normally. If the, the guard here know what they're doing, they normally bypass that and they go directly to so that wouldn't affect the outside water. Sure. Only in period. Yeah. And if they don't know what they're doing, don't hire them. 
Because that's that's how long, that's how the sprinkling systems are supposed to be set up. Yeah. So they can take care of themselves even if the house is off. Got it. Otherwise, all your plants are dying. We what was your first name again? Eric. 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 Okay, Eric. I'm Carl. Carl. Nice to meet you. <laughs> Underneath there, see those two little white buttons? Looks like a knob. Uh -huh. oh. Okay, those are now the off and on controls for water. No more valves. Okay. <coughs> there, push pull. Okay. So. If they're pushed in, which they are right now, the water is on. If you pull it out, then no. you have no water. Oh. No water, okay. Water. You press it or no you press it. When you push them in, I'll push in. I'll they're on. If you pull it out, they're out. Okay. That's a new design. No more. Yeah. Yeah. Those Thank down you. the road would always get frozen and stuck. So now they went to these, which does not happen anymore. Okay, and you'll have a pair underneath that one. You'll also have the single over there behind the toilet in the master. Okay. So every every one has its own shut off. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Now it's say like if he's at work and you're out here by yourself and you see that dripping and you can't stop it, then you run outside and oh, have no thermal. Pull that lever. Okay. Mm -hmm. That's why it's so warm here. We have no, th we have no thermal. These are set up yet. Oh. Uh, they're coming to this. They pass really fragile. What's like that? It's, it's it, fast. It feels right? like it, yeah. But no, you know what? We've been using them now for over two years. It's been great. Okay. Yeah. That fan up there, okay, uh. is a censored fan. And if it detects too much moisture in here, it will turn itself on. So yeah, so if you hear it go on, maybe sometimes in the middle of the night, it's just doing what it's supposed to do, okay? The manual switch for it is right here, okay? And they're very quiet. Oh, we're, 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 sorry. Ah, okay? But anytime you see one of these stands with this grill, with this three extra little slots on the side, that will always tell you that that is a sensor fan. Because see, this one in here is different. That's not a sensor fan, that's just a switch. Okay. Yeah. Okay. I'll always let you know which one. So sense is right there. Yeah. Yeah. He can uh, he can adjust the sense? No. Not that I have some people disconnected. But some some they have a, which one is it? this this one. Yeah, yeah, the other ones used to have a yeah. Not anymore. Okay. Like they got tired of uh, people going uh -oh. seeing here. There's a crack. There's a crack at the at the top as well. Here, yeah. Corner. Mm -hmm. And here too. Yeah. Here. Oh, but I like I like their cabinet. It's um, it's painting great. It's the upgraded. And yeah. It's self closing. Yeah, it's nice. Because it's painted great. Oh, you have the best cabinet. Here's the other half of that. Communication panel I was telling you about. Okay, so whoever comes out, they may get into that to hook you up. Depends upon what you do. See the attic access? They need to be painted. Oh, that look up. No, that means look up. Okay, that night up there. Okay, that's a dummy light. We give you that for free because you didn't order any fan or anything. But that box is pre-wired for fan and light. Okay, that's why you got you know different switches. This is the dimmer for the light. Okay. What was for that? Fire sprinkler system. One, two, three, four, four. Okay. Yeah. In the house, they look a little nicer than the ones out in the garage. What they call it, decor. Okay. Now you also have this extra switch here. I believe we ordered the fan. Maybe we just ordered the pre wire No, seating fan pre wire Pre-wired. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. This switch right here, and every room is going to have one of these. It's called a half hot. 
okay? And what that means is connected to one of the plugs in the room, or like a table lamp. Mm -hmm. All right, and the easy way to find it, see how that plug is upside down compared to all the rest? So, yeah, good to know. Yeah, so now you know which one it is. Yes, yes. You're not running around trying to figure it out. Got it, got it. They find things. So, this switch is connected to something unique. Yes. Mm -hmm. Something unique. Yeah. Very comparable. Let's yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's take a look at Oh, one of those mystery fans. Yeah, this is upgrade. Mm -hmm. This is upgrade. I love it. That GFI. This is upgrade. Right that up that wall plug. GFCI. Mm -hmm. Controls all the bathrooms. That controls all of the other bathrooms. So, yeah. So if you plug in something into the master or maybe downstairs and you've got no power, come and check and see if this has been tripped. Okay. Line will be down. So reset. Sure. You know it's the number one thing that trips those women curves. Iron curves. Iron curve with iron for women. Pops was over the top. Too much power. Always I had one guy who kept tripping that all the time for a while back, and I'll be for the life of me, we couldn't figure out what was wrong. In one bathroom, he had a coffee pot. And then his girls would go in there and start doing all their stuff and drink it. So you can't put that in here. Coffee pot. Yeah, because the coffee has a heating element, and that yeah. holds a lot of power. You got this extra too. Yeah, that's. That's not uh, extra. That's a whole whole house. We choose it, right? No, that that that's no no that's upgrade. That that, that you pay you pay like two two three thousand for yeah, those. Two stub outs down there. Yeah. All the I, I think it's totally worth it. Totally worth it. Yeah, cause he, cause this is customized. If you want to customize, you you pay probably more than what build they charge, and also those. Yeah, we we'll pay for the the yeah. cabinets. Yeah, let me show you something over here. This is really really important. Hi. Really really important. Okay. Yes. Uh, how important that is. I don't have to talk about this because very, very few people get this. Okay. Okay. This tub, for whatever reason, it's just the way they make them, does not have an overflow uh, in it. So you plug it up and you put water in it. Oh, don't walk away. No yeah. overflow. I had a lady do that. She flooded below. Mm -hmm. So, yeah. Why? Yeah. Why didn't just the way they're made? I don't know. <laughs> I, I even went to Home Depot and I saw them stacked up in thing. Every one of them was the same. So I want to let you know there is no. This is over. a very important. That is yeah. a very because the number Good. one thing that hurts your house is water. Water, yeah. Water damage. Water damage. Yeah. Water damage. Yeah. Yeah. All right, now let's talk about your washer dryer. Are you relocating it or are you buying a new? I'm buying new. Okay, then we're gonna worry about hey, how do you change the hoses because you're getting brand new ones. I hope you got a gas dryer. Okay. Did you get a gas dryer? Uh, not ordering yet. Oh, buy gas. Okay. Don't buy electric. Sure. Okay. Do you have the facility for electric? But electric takes twice as long to dry clothes. Yeah. Okay, so, yeah. Yeah, yeah many people they saw this plug they said oh that's electric yeah, yeah. so <laughs> this is the, for the uh the washing machine, washing machine. Yeah. yeah and that's what we're dry correct and, and that's it. the guys it's already on uh -huh. it's the thing if you get the right guy you can hide that seam pretty good because every room like right there you'll always have a seam yeah, right, here. right there across the door okay. I see. and the right guy can make it disappear pretty good Okay, some guys, uh uh, but the right guy, and I turned you on to a good carpet guy. His name is Tony Martinez. Tony Martinez. He even did my house. Yeah, sounds okay. like. And uh, if I only, if I let somebody work in my house, you know he's good. <laughs> Otherwise, he wouldn't be there. That's okay. probably true. <laughs> Think about it. I've known Tony for. Maybe you give Tony's name to me. Yeah, tag tag his name to me. Oh no, you please, can't, you can't. Have it. Please, please. Yeah, because <laughs> I have coffee in my house too. In fact, not only does he lay 
repair, reinstall. He also has two sons that work for him that run a cleaning service. So every oh. time I need my carpet cleaned, oh. I call him up. Yeah, and yeah. They please. Do. Yeah, please. Tony is a good, good guy. Yeah. Tony is not baloney, right? Not Tony baloney. <laughs> is, that, is that correct? This height? Yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's the height. That's pretty low. Yeah, well, probably are these days. Uh, one way to save, uh, what do you call it? Material. Uh -huh. In fact, I actually don't like it because me being an older guy now, and I don't like to slip and fall. So what I do when I get in, you hold it. I hang on to the top. Hell yes, I do. <laughs> so I don't bounce it off the wall. I already did that trick once. Hurt my hip for a week. Jeez. So now you gotta be careful. Now I. Yeah. The, the number one like accident cause for the older people is uh, slip. Like my 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 mom, mm -hmm. she slipped, but she couldn't. She just couldn't uh, like heal as fast as we can. Like take him forever, yeah. like two three years. She still feel the pain. Yeah, I know all about that. And you know what? Sometimes it never goes away. It might it could. settle down a little right. bit, but it doesn't go away. Never go back to 100%. Yeah. And yeah, no more 100%. That's a bitch about getting older, Joe. <laughs> How old are you? How old are you? How am I? Oh, no, you, you guess. Take 42. Guess. 42, a good guess, but a little bit older. 55. No, it's too old for me. Younger. 46? No, younger, younger. Oh, you're younger than that? Yeah, younger okay, than that. Jeez, <laughs> oh, I'm going to be 70. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm like, uh, yeah. I'm like half, half, half of your age. Oh, 30? 35. Oh my yeah, exactly God. half. Jeez. Yeah. How do you mean that? I mean, well, after so many, like a year and a half, one doesn't close. Yeah. Yeah. Sounds like that. Yeah. <laughs> That's normal. When you have a big door like that, you're going to have a little bit of yes. warpage. Sure. Hey, Carl, do you know when they're going to install the, the cover of the... Today? Today, okay. Right here in the box. Oh. In fact, Johnny was getting ready to do it. When I came over, I said, get okay. out of here. I'm going to walk this out. Okay. It's okay. It's in the box. In here. Uh, you know. Your what? Oh. Yeah. She's got that upgrade. The one that yeah, with this, this, with this stainless steel. Oh, yeah. It's another plastic one. That's not easy to learn how to use. Your trash cans will go right here. Yeah. Trash can go over there. Trash can. All right. And we put these in again too, right before you take possession. Otherwise, uh, somebody steals them. Is his yard bigger than a model, right? He's, he's got a big yard because yeah. it has a the corner lot. They probably paid a premium for it. It's a big yard. Yeah. You mean this garden is bigger than the garden? Yes, it's bigger than the garden. 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 Like especially I mean, the gap is pretty big right here. Okay. See? They can adjust it. Yeah. They can adjust that yeah. a little bit. Yeah, this yeah. this gap is something. Yeah, let them adjust it. It's upscale cabinet. Oh, there, oh, there, there we go. Okay. okay. Stay Until it pushes all the air okay. out of the line. Oh, that's what happens. Oh tongue, 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 tongue. We're going kai board. And you notice you got different size burners? Mm -hmm. And those two is not flat. What's that? Those two, they're the two. Oh, no, just just sitting sitting here. Here. I just try to adjust it. Oh. Don't touch it. Mm -hmm. So you just yell. Your filters. Yes, yeah. They're underneath here. Okay, these pop out. Okay, from the dishwasher. They're mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. We're gonna step out. The backyard. The backyard. Yeah. 36. Oh, yes. Yeah. He's, char he's charging it right now. With the freedom. Oh, he's charging. Oh, mm -hmm. right. He's charging. Do you think it's really difficult to move in these two? Yes. Mm -hmm. And they can move it for you, 
but the cost of moving it is like a couple thousand dollars because I had one guy and another try to do it and he only wanted to move it like 10 inches I said dude it ain't worth it man <laughs> Jesus okay are we gonna grab our shoes go outside oh okay the roof we got that goes all the way around the house here for the drainage yeah Okay, the city makes us leave it like that because this is considered unfinished property. When you go to do your landscaping, you can level that all you want. Just maybe add a little more drain spouts. And whoever you call, make sure they know about that. I'm sure they do. Okay, right there, see the little block, that brown cap sticking up? That is a plumbing clean out. You may have two or three of those around the house. And again, too, just like the electricians, the plumbers are getting smarter these days. So now, if you have a blockage somewhere, I guarantee you that one right there goes directly to the kitchen sink. They don't try to run a snake from the street, which doesn't work. They open up the zone, they go right to it, clean it out. So when you do your landscaping, you can level those all you want. Just don't ever bury it. Because if the guy does need to come and get into it, he'll be digging around, look, he'll tear up your yard and he won't fix it. Is this doable by homeowner to clean the clean up? I wouldn't. You wouldn't? <laughs> no. Okay. No. Even like you. One thing <laughs> I've learned to, to stay away from is plumbing. Electric? Yeah. Plumbing broke. Oh. Uh, what about that one? That, again, too, was left for the drainage. Now, if you have a small animal, a dog or something, yeah. put some screen in front of it. Okay. Yeah, I don't think they'll allow you to cover it up. I mean, plug it, but put a screen. Okay. I have a little puppy, and that's the first thing she'd want to do is try to get out that hole. <laughs> no running out away way. from the house. Ah. Oh, yeah. And these doors, just so you know, in fact, that one should run by her. These doors over here, these glass doors, very heavy. Okay? So the best way to move them is here and here. So you can push pull. Okay. Uh, okay. Very easy. I had one little Chinese lady about this big, probably weighed all of about eight pounds. She pulled the hand in there and she ripped the handle right out of there. <laughs> See these pins right here? Mm -hmm. If these don't depress when it hits here, it won't allow you to knock it. It's a okay. it's a fail safe, so you can't lock yourself outside. <laughs> oh. Okay, that ain't for spraying the kid. Alright. Okay. You have a hand soap dispenser you got. Okay? Now the old style. You just have to crawl underneath the cabinet. Screw the bottle uh, uh, or fill it up. Uh -huh. You don't do that anymore. So, what are we going to do? You just lift it up, unlock the top up, pour it in. That's not going to screw it. Okay. Yeah. Let's do it. It's, it's a plastic. Yeah. Okay. I'm going to let them do that. But that that's up. Uh, I'll tell you what to do. My fingers are too fat. My fingers are too fat. You get it? 